Hey everybody, my name is Sunny. So there is only one more week until Halloween and I thought I would share with you one last quick decorating tip that will probably come in handy. I love Halloween. I remember the first time I went trick-or-treating was six months after I first came to Canada. I had no idea what it was about and I didn't even wear a costume. But I remember my neighbor took me around along with her kids and I thoroughly enjoyed receiving candy. Anyways, let's get started with the DIY. We'll be making the spider web out of tissue paper. But since it's rather large, I will take that away and demonstrate the folding and cutting process on this smaller sheet of paper. Start by folding the paper in half, corner to corner. Fold it in half again. Then fold it in half two more times. Then take your pencil and copy the pattern I'm drawing here, all the way to the tip. But since I'm only demonstrating here, I won't bother drawing all the way to the end. Then cut it out. Now you know the basic folding and cutting pattern, let's get legit and make the real thing with tissue. The lightness and delicateness of the tissue paper kind of reminds me of the fragility of spider webs. Be careful when working with it though, as it tears easily. But if it does tear, just tape it back together. I'm freehanding the cutting here, and if you feel confident enough, go ahead and do the same. It's very easy really. Cut the pattern all the way to the tip of the triangle, then unfold to magically reveal the beautiful spider web. But of course, a spider web cannot be without a spider. So on a piece of black paper, draw a simple spider shape. I'm using my white eyeliner here to draw so you guys can see. Cut it out, and you have a very scary spider. Decide where you want your spider web to be, and tape it in place. I also made a orange one because I had a lot of orange tissue paper for my last DIY. Or perhaps the spider drank too much pumpkin spice latte and pooped out orange spider webs. Stick the spider onto the web with some double-sided tape, and you're all set for your decoration. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, remember to give it a thumbs up and remember to subscribe for new DIY videos every Thursday. I will see you guys next week. Bye.